I, hey, here's a website I've been working on for a little while. Uh, they're for selling uh, local goods from a farm. And uh, it's nothing too fancy, but it's just a little online store. Uh, so basically, I got these uh, these buttons that are supposed to make sure that you don't order too much of a product. It has to stay within the stock. There's a whole bunch of tests and stuff written to try to confirm that it actually does that, but you can also remove stuff from your cart. And uh, it's a big work in progress, as you can see. This is too big. It's pretty ugly, actually, in general, but... Yeah, I just finished some Stripe integration, so if I hit Submit here, it should create some products on Stripe and then redirect me to a checkout page. And yeah, you'll see here I'm buying one tomato and five campanulas. And then if I put in my email address and the test uh, card, then you put any future dates any three numbers, uh, any name, and any postal code. And click pay. Don't save because it's not real. <laughs> and now I don't have a real success page, but you can see here it redirects me to my local host slash checkout slash success. So I got a successful credit card payment there. So once I actually uh, confirm my identity and whatnot, I can take actual credit card payments. And yeah, it's pretty cool. Stripe is awesome, guys.